there's just so much fear and concern for people using Android TV, Google TV devices that the minute Google pushed down a brand new update, your favorite third party applications are now going to be blocked. And more importantly, from that point forward, all of your favorite custom applications, your modded applications, basically apps that Google haven't verified are now all going to be blocked on your streaming device. Well, I can tell you today, as of the 16th of September, I can now categorically confirm that your applications, your favorite third party streaming applications, your custom applications, they will not be impacted as long as you follow these steps. And this was posted a few days ago on Android Authority and they covered the basics about exactly what Google are planning to do, which is to enable app verification, which means that if your application or specifically if the developer of your application, if they haven't verified their identity to Google, then those applications will never be allowed to be installed on certified devices, which you can see there. Now from Google's point of view, this is to prevent bad actors or malicious people pushing out applications on the Google Play Store, which maybe contain malware or spyware or do data mining or data logging under the protection of being anonymous. But now because of the verification, if they haven't verified their identity, those applications will never be allowed on these official devices. Now it talks about how this may actually come into effect. And previously people thought it would just be with Play Protect. And as you know, with Play Protect, you can actually turn that off. But in reality, they're not going to use that. They're going to rely on something called the Android Developer Verifier. And this is going to be a brand new system or app. And this will be responsible for validating whether an application package is associated with a verified Android developer. So random application comes up on your device. This Android developer verifier will check it or scan it. If it notices that, oh, this streaming application or this modded application is by a developer that's not authorized, that hasn't been vetted, hasn't been checked out, the application will be blocked and most likely removed from your device. So and that seemingly looks like how they plan to enforce these new restrictions on all certified devices. So whether you have a Nvidia Shield or a Chromecast or on streaming box or Tiva Streamo 4K, Whichever device you've got, as long as it's a certified device, these frictions are most likely going to happen fairly soon. Now, fortunately, as I mentioned at the start of this video, I do believe there's an easy fix for this and something that actually Google mentioned directly on their FAQ page. So without speculation, without looking at random sources directly on the Google website, we can see in the FAQ for the Android developer verification, a key question, which is, will Android debug bridge ADB install work without registration. And they say here clearly, as a developer, you are free to install applications without any kind of verification with ADB. So there we have it guys. So directly from the horse's mouth that Google are confirming that as a developer, as long as you go via the ADB route, you are free to install any application that you like without verification. Yes, it may not be as easy as just, you know, browsing to a website, clicking on install, or browsing through an app store and installing something. But if you have to type in a single line command to install something via ADB, in fact, I'm sure there's actually applications out there that will allow you to install applications, but actually be running ADB commands under the hood. So as long as it comes in via ADB route, you're free to install any application that you like. And furthermore, it says, uh, look, I mean, they even use the word as modify or hack. So if I want to modify or hack some APK and install it on my own device, do I need to verify this hacked or cracked or modified APK? And again, the answer is apps installed using ADB won't require verification. So really guys, no need to panic, no need to ditch your Android TV or bin your Google TV device. As you've seen here today, as long as you install these applications, they could be modded applications, cracked applications, custom applications, install them via ADB and you'll automatically bypass any kind of verification check. And that way you can install really any application you like. So I do think that's fairly positive news. And again, if you are somebody that likes to customize, likes to tweak, likes to modify their streaming device, it looks like Google TV is still the platform of choice. I know before there was some news that they're going to block all kinds of side loading, all kinds of unverified application installs, but looks like there's a fairly straightforward and easy way out of it. So really appreciate your support. Do leave me a comment below. Let me know what you think, and I'll hopefully catch up with you guys real soon. Thanks.